Oh, no. I... Oh, God. <laughs> Hello, my name is Megan Ruth. I'm a Canadian living in London, England, and I react to British things. So today I'm going to be reacting to Series 2, Episode 6 of The Inbetweeners. I have reacted to the previous episodes already. If you want to watch those, I'll post a link to the playlist down below. We're at the last episode of the second season. How did that happen? <laughs> we only have one season left after this, and then a couple films, but yeah. Man, time is going so fast. But anyway, just like the majority of my reactions, this video will be edited and it will be censored. If you wanted to see the unedited, uncensored reaction, I'll also post a link to my Patreon down below. Thank you to my patrons for supporting me, especially my top tier patrons. Joseph Michael Mitch, Brian James, Daniel Des, John Reese, Kane, Thomas, Robson, James, A. Gems, Andy, and Des C. Let's just get started, shall we? <gasps> Oh, shit. Revising uh, hard? Oh, yeah, shit. Are you okay? Sorry, a bit wet. Mum will get it out, though, not to worry. Sorry to disturb you. I wanted to ask if you could do me a favour. Yes. You don't know what it is yet? Sorry, go on. Can I come over to yours and revise sociology with you? Yes, God, yes. Come over any time. Come over now. <laughs> well, I can't come over now. No, no, of course not. But this is really great of you, Simon. It's so hard to revise at the moment because we've got the builders in. Oh, right. Is that, is that a euphemism? Sorry? You know, like, um, like having the painters in. Sorry, I, I don't really get it. <laughs> oh, no, no, don't worry. It wasn't that funny. What did you mean? Come on, Simon, what does it mean? Oh, just, um, having the painters in means being on your period, right? Ooh. So when you said you couldn't concentrate because you had the builders in, I thought that might be a euphemism for you being on your period. Right. Since when is that a euphemism for being on your period? I have never heard that. Is that a British thing? I've never heard that in my life. That's a weird, a weird euphemism. I'm not sure if I like that. Okay, I see. It wasn't that funny, really. No, it's fine. I get it. Um, see you tonight, then? Cool. S see you tonight. <laughs> Amazing, yeah? Just have a look at this for me, will you, Simon? Sure. What is it? It's my revision schedule. What am I looking for? Does it say anywhere, listen to Simon witter on about his futile crush on Carly D'Amato? Don't be a dick. We're mates and I want you to be the first... Goodbye, Simon. Come on, I just wanted to talk... Goodbye! <laughs> Why are you revising geography? You don't do geography. They're not letting you take an extra S level, are they? Oh, no, it's for Carly. She just needs a bit of extra help. So when are you revising for your own exams? You know, the ones in the next couple of days? I'm not, really. I can always resit. How's your revision going? Yeah, not bad. Pretty good. Got an excellent schedule sorted, colour coded, and balancing my time. Every time they say your revision, I think they mean Eurovision, like the Eurovision Song Contest. Your revision, your revision. God. I'm well, got some drinks here to help, Pro Plus, that sort of thing. Right. And nothing's fucking going in. Nothing. I mean, look at this. I must have read about the accountability of legislatures to citizens 50 times, and I still don't know what it means. I'm starting to doubt if legislatures is even a word. It doesn't look like a word anymore. None of them do. They just look squiggles on a page. I mean, is this a word? Yes. <laughs> Council. Is it? It doesn't <laughs> look right. I think you probably need a bit more sleep, mate. <gasps> yeah. And maybe lay off the power drinks a bit? These are full of electrolytes, which, yes. if they exist, are good for the brain. Think of your stomach, though. Even one of those drinks makes my shits come out too fast. I'm just saying, like rusty water. Yeah, yeah, you need to sleep. If you're studying for something, sleep is so important. You need to study really hard and then get a full night's sleep and the information kind of sinks into your brain. I'm not sure how it does that, but that's, I've, I've heard that. And, and it worked when I was in university as well. Um, so yeah, so study really hard, sleep, and then the information absorbs into your brain. Not sleeping doesn't help you at all. Yeah. See, there's this guy at school, right? So she's dumb you for this bloke. Well, that's a lucky escape. I thought she was a f***ing No, she hasn't dumped me, Dad. I think I love her. So you're back with a pig? Dad, we didn't split up. Uh, and please, don't call her a pig. It's just that uh, I'm getting a bit jealous because I, I think she might have seen a few more people than I have. I'd say that's a given, isn't it? If she's got off with more than one person, she's beating you hands down. <laughs> Look, mate, uh. women are like fairground rights. Mental. Your only hope is that when she wants some, you do the best you can with your tiny equipment. Oh, and check where she is the whole time. That's the only way you'll be totally sure she's not sucking off this other bloke. 
Right. Thanks, Dad. Although, let's face it, she probably is. Fancy a beer? Thanks for coming round. It's a really nice surprise. That's all right. Just wanted to be near you. Yeah. Shouldn't you be revising as well? No, I'm not allowed. Teachers say because I've got a photographic memory, it wouldn't be fair on the other kids. If Jay's made up memory skills a bad revision plan, then Neil's topped it. A sitting. Do you guys not say studying? Like studying for exams, you say revising. I don't think I've heard studying once in this whole show. So do you guys just not say studying? Like I'm studying for exams, you say revising. Interesting. Very interesting. God, I think I do know it. Amazing. You've done really, really well, honestly. I couldn't have done it without you. Thank you so much. Ooh. Damn. Wow. It's late. I should go. Oh, sure. God, maybe I'll actually pass geography now. Thanks again. So he'd finally worn her down, and Simon didn't know whether to come in his pants or text his friends. In the <laughs> end, he did both. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, God, no. Phil? <sighs> Phil? Oh. Oh, no. I... Oh, God. Phil. Oh, Jesus. Oh. I thought it was a fart, sir. I thought it was safe. In a term of low points, this was it. Literally. Okay. That... Yeah, I, I don't do well with that kind of humour. I really don't. It just... <laughs> okay. I have a very fragile stomach. <laughs> very fragile. Just the thought of that. Oh. Anyway. The bottom. And yet as I waddled to the toilet, I felt strangely optimistic. Things couldn't get any worse. Painful as it may seem, in a way I was free. Free to reinvent myself as whatever I wanted. Right after I changed my underpants. And what's in that bag? Well, uh, in there are the trousers and pants I wore to school this morning. What's going on? Are you doing a fashion show or something? It's a long story, Neil, but the salient facts are these. Recently, I've had a bit of a nervy tummy due to stress, I think. And all the energy drinks and Pro Plus. Perhaps. And in the exam, I took a risk and it backfired. I went to fart and instead shit myself. <laughs> <laughs> are you joking? No, I'm not. In front of everyone? <laughs> yup. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yes, and because of my high heart rate, the school nurse spent three hours calming me down before I went back into an empty exam hall to finish. Hence, I'm late. Apologies. How do you think you did? I think I might have failed, Neil. I was a bit distracted. Mm -hmm. Hi. All right. Do you want a drink, babes? Um, actually, Jay, could we go and have a quick chat outside? Yeah, of course. I only want to be with you anyway. I see these twats all the time. Yeah, go on, muff before, mates. Oh, Just God, the two of us then. Break up with them. And Will. Yeah, not sure who'll be joining us. We'll still have a laugh, though. Me and you. Yeah, of course. Cheers, mate. Cheers. No, I'm not. I'm really not. I promise you. But you are for me. And you're a bit needy, and it scared me because I'm not ready for that kind of thing. All the texting, all the calls, it's too intense, it's too much. Well... Yeah. Well, I can change. I'll change. And, oh, God. you know, I won't call no. you for ages. For weeks. Just... You know, tell me what you want me to be and I'll be exactly that. Oh, I'll be no, exactly that. Just No. Just you please make... don't split up with me. You're making it worse. Sorry, Jay. I've made up my mind. I've made you a CD. Oh, right. Thanks. Oh, it's nothing. Although the songs on there really do say a lot of the things that I want to say, but sort of better. Simon, listen, there's something I've got to tell you. Oh, God, I know. I feel mm. it too. I've always felt it for years and now it's happened and here we are. No. I'm back with Tom. You all right, Simon? Get us a seat, Carls. I'll get the drinks in, yeah? Oh, you're back with Tom. Yes. So that was all you wanted to say? Not that you love me? I'm really sorry, Simon. Come on, let's go. This place is cursed. Oh, my God, it's haunted. No, Neil. Well, it might be. <laughs> like one of those ghost stories, you know, like Harry Potter or the Bible. Maybe I could have one more pint. I did shit myself in front of the school today. No, nope, we're off. Are you going to wait for Carly? No, she dumped him. I wasn't dumped, it was, it was more a mutual decision. She mutually decided she fancied her boyfriend more. Yes. Come on, Jay. 
<laughs> Come on, mate, it'll be all right. We'll get you some chips. I think now's a good time to tell you I'll probably puke in your car. Great. Ah, uh, don't worry. Won't make this shit heap any worse. <laughs> Shotgun. You've perked up. Yeah, well, I suppose there's plenty more clunge in the sea. Yeah, that's it. And next term will be the top year, which means picking a bird. Oh, yeah. Oh, God, next term. Do you think anyone's going to remember my little accident? Yes, of course they will. <laughs> well, at least they won't call you Briefcase Mong anymore. Well, that's good. No, they'll call you <laughs> Shit Pants Mong. <laughs> oh, shitty, shitty, bang, bang. <laughs> <laughs> Any more? <laughs> Wayne Pooney. Take shot. <laughs> Dr. Pooh, the lion, the witch, and the specky kid who shit himself. <laughs> we can keep this up all summer, you know. Brilliant. Looking forward to it. <laughs> Brad shit. Bum log millionaire. All right. How about Vladimir Putin? Who? Oh? Shitty, shitty bang, bang that I just had me in stitches. I love that. And it's real, too. Those are lived experiences when you're that age. Like, I remember my first relationship in high school. I was a needy fuck. <laughs> I was needy. That's something that you learn as you get older, you know, how to trust and to, you know, it's all, it's all to do with self-worth and stuff. So very relatable. I just wish there was less shit involved. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the reaction. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe if you haven't done so already. See you next time. Bye.